Hi guys, today I'm gonna show you how to transform my SQL sales table into a P4 table so we can show it in yearly basis and monthly basis like an OLED dimension. As you can see, we have year, we have month, and we have sales quantity. Uh, first, let's see how many years that we have in this table. Okay, with this query, we can get the seven rows of years from 2010 to 2016. Then we will transform this rows into a column like the yearly sales table. And the other, we will transform the sales month into a monthly sales table from January to December. Okay, first to get the result like this first what we need to do is to group it this table based on the product and then we will summarize the, the sales quantity based on the sales year and sales month okay let's start to make the query okay guys with this common query we will get this result so then we will try to select a product then we will summarize the sales quantity based on the year let's try to select the sales quantity for the 2010 we will name it this field with 2010 from sales history detail and we will group it by uh, product okay uh, let's start to execute this query yeah now we get the total for the sales quantity in 2010 so if we want to make it for all years we will copy this to 2016 Okay, let's start to see the result. Yeah, now we will get the yearly sales uh, for each year from 2010 to 2016. Actually, if you want to get the summarize for each year, we can add the roll app yeah with this uh, script we will get the total of 
each column let's see the result yeah at the bottom of the table we will get the total for each column okay with this query uh, the time will be reduce it rather than using a conventional query okay now let's start to make the query for monthly sales with this we can copy and change the sales month into one we will change it into January February March April May June and so on yeah as you can see the month is on is based on the number one is for January and so on October, November, December. We will erase this row. Mm. Okay, let's start to execute the script. Okay, now we we just get the result. Now we can transform the sales table into a pivot table. you can see the total of each column okay uh, thanks for watching my video and I hope it can be useful if you want to show your sales table uh, if you have a huge data then this query will be useful if you want to show it into a pivot table thanks for watching my video don't forget to share and subscribe my channel you can subscribe over here thanks for watching and bye